Hey friends, it's EK from EK Gorm Designs and I am sneaking in because I have the latest White Rose Crafts subscription kit. I have the March, ah, they have the March Blue Sky subscription kit right here and I thought I'd go ahead and open it up and show you what's inside this month. So here we go. All I know about this is it's called the Blue Skies kit. So I am seeing this for the first time with you. Let's see if I can get everything out. So there we go. That is everything. Now I'm going to put everything to the side and go through it little by little. We'll start with, ooh, it is a Scrapberry ink. It's the pigment ink from Scrapberry. And it is a really fun color. Let's see if I can find a little scrap piece of paper. Here we go. So it's got that lovely pigment blue ink. It stays wet for a little bit so you can actually um, emboss on this ink if you are quick enough. So, Scrapberry Blue ink. And then we have some buttons and we have a nice collection of, oh this looks like it's spring is on the way and blue skies are on the way with these buttons with the floral. So yes, a collection of buttons. Ooh, flowers. This is the first time we've really had flowers in a subscription kit. So these are the nice kind of flat kind. But it's a nice collection of blue flowers. It looks like you've got maybe three colors, a dark color, a medium color, and a light. And of course I've stuck things to my paper now. Let's take those off to the side. Let's see what else. Ooh, we got ribbon. I love ribbon. We've got a bunch of different types of ribbons here. We have a piece of lace. Oh. Okay, so a piece of wide blue, piece of navy blue, piece of cream, and a piece of lace. And you get a good, that's over a foot. So you get a good amount of lace. You get a good amount of ribbon. It's going to do what you want it to do. <clears throat> And then here are the Sparkle Blend sequins. These are called Sunny Skies, which I think go beautifully with blue skies. So it is a collection of gold and yellow and blue sequins. I open it, but every time I do, we all know I spill it everywhere. So I'm not going to do that today. Now I'd heard about this. I'd heard rumor this existed. But I am so glad to see it actually does. It's an embossing folder. I adore bossing folders. If you don't know what an embossing folder is, it goes through your paper cutting machine. There is a fold for that, but it will actually emboss um, this texture. Let's see, can you see the texture? Yeah, it's a ribbon pattern. So that's going to be really fun to play with and something different than we've seen in these the kits. I like embossing folders. I have lots of them. I probably don't use them as much as I should, but I have lots of them. Okay. Next is our stamp set. This is from, I want to say Kaiser Craft, but I very likely, oh, it is Kaiser Craft. And it is the Golden Grove stamp set. And I love it because it's this distressed vintage postmark looking thing, and it's got some florals. So a little bit for everybody. Let's dive into the specialty papers or the specialty cards. Usually, these are, let's see, let's see what this is. So, if you haven't seen this before, this is the shaker card from Jill, um, Jilly Bean Soup. So, you get a shaker bit, and it actually adheres to this side of the card frame, and you can fill it with shakers and make it shake. But when you open up, the cloud stays right there. So love these, and it comes with its own card, or envelope. It comes with an envelope. I can do this, I can speak to so the envelope. And then you've got a textured card here with a coordinating envelope. And this is smaller than the A2 size, but yeah. And then this is larger than an A2 size, but you've got this beautiful card with the scalloped D edges. And it's really good thick quality paper. And then you have, ooh, another one. You get four cards this month. So another dark blue textured card frame. So three card frames 
and the shaker card, which I'm going to put back together, I swear. I'm going to put them safely up here. Okay. So now we come to our six by six pieces of paper, which are always the most exciting to me because right now all I know is of this beautiful butterfly design. I don't even know who the papers are. <gasps> is it textured? What is it? I can do this. Come on out. You can do it. They like fit perfectly in the Ziplocs. I love that they come Ziploc. They don't ever come bent. So it's not textured, but it's like the butterflies are almost glossy. So there we go. We're going to go through these. I got the butterfly. I'm working on it. I have, again, there's shiny parts to it. This floral. I have this really cool pattern here. Like It's almost like stones. Stripes. Isn't that fun? Like it's it's not metallic, but it's got a sheen to it. Oh, this one's cool. This one's got some sentiments in it, so you can actually cut this one up and use the sentiment pieces in it. See if you can see it. It's got things like never give up, be yourself, worry less, live more, believe in yourself, you'll be unstoppable. Every day is a fresh start. It's all good. Breathe. Uh, escape the ordinary. <laughs> Lots of fun. I can and I will. I don't know. This is going to be a huge debate. Do I cut this up or do I to use the sentiment strips or do I? Ooh, we'll find out. Okay, we've got some denim. It feels like it's two pieces here. It is. So we've got a really cool denim. A white piece that's distressed, almost like concrete. A marbled. I say it looks like an ocean, but it's probably supposed to look like a marbled piece. Two pieces again. There we go. A really deep navy. Ooh, I love this. This is wood grain. Uh, ooh, another fun one. There's little words in there. A white and navy floral. A piece that looks like sky. Oh, this one's fun. This is another one you can cut up and use um, the sentiments. That one I will be cutting up and using these individually. Ooh, look how pretty this one is. And then the last piece is another distressed. It almost looks like vintage wallpaper. So lots and lots of fun papers this month. Let's see how many are they. We'll count them and relook at them. One, two. This was supposed to go fast. Three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine. I can't do this. Ten, eleven. I think there's another one over there. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen pieces of six by six paper this month. And there's really a cool, they all clearly coordinate with each other, but they're also incredibly diverse. And then we have a piece of Aspire Gold Metallic. You can see how metallic that is. So this is eight and a half by 11 piece of gold metallic paper, which I'm casting weird shadows with. <coughs> and then just like the smaller six by six piece, we've got this giant 12 by 12 piece with Oh, and the cool thing is, okay, so it's Kaiser Craft, and the paper collection's called, it's the Indigo Skies Collection, and this is Blue Moon. So, you've got large sentiments and some, oh, we've got so many things we can make with this. Anyway, so that is this month's paper, or uh, subscription kit. It's the March Blue Skies Paper Kit. You get four card frames, lots of six by six paper, ribbon, stamp set, embossing powders and all kinds of fun embellishments this month. Stay tuned, you'll see me get to make five fast cards in my three part series where I end up making 15 cards. And check out what the design team's doing because they're doing all kinds of cool things over at White Rose Crafts. Thanks for tuning in today. Have fun and until later, happy crafting.